Hello and welcome to Adobe's Circle of Influence. I'm your host, Joe Escovito, and today we'll be talking about battling imposter syndrome. Now let me ask you, have you ever been scared to speak in public or even post online because you thought to yourself, you know what, I'm not really a thought leader. Or if I post something, are people gonna make fun of me? Am I gonna look stupid in front of my colleagues or peers? I've been there. I think most of us have. In fact, three out of four people are terrified of speaking in public. And that was definitely the case for me for most of my life. I was a shy kid with a speech impediment growing up. And as a result, I was very, very nervous about speaking in public. That continued until I got into my career. And I was terrified about presenting in front of my bosses, or even my clients. And during that time, I saw so many of my peers get promoted because they were the ones you know, speaking up. And I was like, gosh, I gotta do something about it. So I signed up for Toastmasters and after a few years, I got a bit more comfortable speaking in front of public and now on camera. Flash forward a couple years and LinkedIn launches video. And so it was all the rage, all my friends, all my peers were on it. They were getting tons of engagement. And meanwhile, I was super nervous. I didn't want to put anything on video because I was like, you know, my voice, I hate my voice. Is my speech impediment going to come out? They can make fun of that. So I really, really dragged my feet for several months. Until one night, I decided, screw it. I'm going to post something. It was the middle of the night. I was like, everyone's going to be sleeping. Who cares? I'll just publish it. And lo and behold, I woke up and there was such positive you know, engagement and reactions from people. And then it got me thinking, why is that the case? Because people want to see us succeed. Think about it. Last time you watched a webinar or a conference, were you thinking to yourself, I hope this is terrible? No! You're thinking, I hope this is worth my time. I hope I'm going to get some kind of value out of it. So next time you're having this issue where you're like, ah, you know what, I'm gonna look stupid. Remember, no one cares about how messy your hair is or how much you're stammering. No one cares. All they care about is the value that you can bring to them. What kind of story can you share that they'll remember? What kind of practical tip can they apply in their day-to-day -day life? So remember that next time you know, that imposter syndrome starts creeping in. You think to yourself, I'm not good enough. Think about your audience. Think about them. How can you make something valuable that they will want to remember and share with others? So thank you so much, and we'll see you on the next episode.